Welcome to the best and most epic uh, size comparison video ever, specifically just because it's so different and beautiful in the way it does it. They're usually from the side, like a regular size comparison, but this is every monster in great HD detail from like a person on the ground's perspective. Leave a like, subscribe, subscribe to Metaball Studios for being awesome, and let's get into it. This is exciting. Oh crap, we see it from the perspective of a French person, not an actual person. I'm just kidding, France is awesome. France is the reason America exists. They whooped the British back then. That's adorable. I never played the game, but I appreciate how cute he looks. You know what I mean? Damn, so it starts out small with stuff that's like on the ground. I would punch the hell out of a gremlin. This simply wouldn't be an issue if I was around. Creeper is basically a suicide bomber, bro. It's gonna blow limbs off. Creepers are why there's so much security at airports. Sully would rip someone's arf like uh, uh, rip someone's arm off. I said rip someone's arf. I feel like I could beat up a, a demigorgon, but a xenomorph, absolutely no chance. Look at them just hanging out together. The flattest butt cheeks in the freaking any monsterverse. This Bowser looks strangely odd. That that Bowser's on the spectrum. I feel like warrior bugs are bigger than that. Maybe everyone in the movie was just a, a midget. I feel like the freaking Balrog's way bigger than that. Right? Am I tripping? Maybe a Gandalf's like really small. Are the hobbits like a foot tall? I never played Kingdom Hearts, but I always thought the dude had cool hair. Stand by that. Is he Kingdom Hearts? The Gears of War is peak, peak contents. Look at that disgusting bastard. That's the end of humanity right there. I loved that game, but I didn't finish it because I don't know, but it was a fun game. Stay Puff Marshmallow Man realistically could be dealt with with some napalm. Kong with his hands on his hips, the sassiest kaiju, I swear. Kong would be relative. Damn, dude, that'd be a sick fight. 1954 Godzilla ver Wow, holy crap. I never pictured him being that big. This size comparison video just took a hell of a turn. Everything's so much bigger from down here. Even little Goshi's a monster. I gotta roll. I'm sorry. I gotta. I gotta rewind that. That's just crazy to me. How big just 1954 is. That's how big he is. I guess I knew that. It just looks so crazy, like crazy HD, because like his height's been common knowledge for a long time. It just this. I don't know. It doesn't seem as big in like other stuff. Like in, I'm thinking of Kaiju Universe. In Kaiju Universe, he's freaking tiny. Yeah, this would be a serious issue. 10,000 of those things invading would absolutely affect the economy. Damn, dude, I gotta play that game. That looks sick as hell. Where's his little legs? Does he not have any legs? Is that him on the ground? Is he walking on his kneecaps? Well, see, this we know specifically because Cloverfield's literally filmed from like a first person perspective. And in the end, the monster's like over the camera. That's the only one in here we actually already knew. Actually, maybe a few more of them. I spoke way too soon. That's crazy, dude. Just straight up blots out the, the sky. For some reason, I pictured Godzilla a little bigger. Like in the end of, or like the beginning of 2019, King of the Monsters, it seems so much bigger. Slanted is way too damn big, bro. Can't Cthulhu appear in like any size as well, like tiny or just like the size of the universe? I think this is his default when he's just a squid dude. But also, I know nothing of Cthulhu. 
My Cthulhu knowledge is primarily based on that Coon and Friends South Park episode. But I feel like that's a really cool version of Cthulhu. I feel like we could kill that. It seems like so much more of an issue in the movie. No, that would be catastrophic. That would for sure like... Damn! Thank God nothing had ball or has balls in video games. I'm so happy that's like a universally agreed on thing. Thank God. I hope it stays that way. This would be a hell of an issue. I think this is when we'd be admittedly just screwed. Oh yeah, the world snake for sure. But see, that's another one you basically kind of see in first person anyway. So it's, you, you already have an idea for how big it is. Dude, Gears of War is the most insane franchise. Look at that worm, damn. For some reason, this doesn't worry me as much as the worm. It's like in the sky, we can keep track of it. We can shoot at it. That worm is gonna go to China in like five seconds. Although that would be very concerning, I'm not gonna lie. As long as I'm not under it, I suppose I could get over it. Dude, I wish we had those, but the world would be so unstable. There'd be like crazy earthquakes from tectonic plates shifting all the time. I feel safe with this, because relatively it couldn't see you unless it did. That's insane though, bro. That's such a crazy concept. This size comparison video is so cool, because like, except for the film core ones, film core ones are pretty cool too, because they're like such, they're like cinematic wonders. But just seeing, like, holy sh... Almost cussed! I held it in last second. I didn't see the foot coming. Damn, dude. That'd be so crazy if Ego rolled up on us. Just a giant schnoz right in our faces. What the hell just knocked them out of place? What's he from? I only see him in memes. With his big finger. There it is. <laughs> oh, I can't, I can't laugh still. I'm still sick. At this point, I'm not even going to worry. I'm not going to give it. There's nothing I can do. That'd be insane though, bro. Wow. That's crazy. Such a crazy concept. I gotta play that game. I've seen that video in like a thousand different memes, but I've never actually played it. That's just the coolest crap ever. This is a beautiful video. This is a really good size comparison channel. I was decently entertained for about 10 minutes. Either way, thanks for watching. I appreciate it. Leave a like down below, subscribe to this channel, and I'll see you next time. <laughs>